Hi guys, welcome to my crazy life. It's future Lori here. I realized while editing this video, I didn't even do a proper intro. I did an outro. So here we go. I took a trip to Ikea and I recorded some decor. I will walk you through everything that I found and talk to you about the things and why I like them in the video coming up. And then at the end, I will show you what I bought. All right, guys, I hope you enjoy. All right, our first stop is always the zip bags for me. These are fantastic. They're super thick. They come in multiple sizes and you can really, really, really um, wash them out and reuse them. That's how good quality they are. And they're very reasonable in price. I love them. Next up, we're looking at all the different blanket options that they have out for winter time. These are fantastic throw blankets. And again, prices are affordable. And then pillow covers. I'm obsessed with pillow covers. I just love the freedom of having four couch pillows and being able to just fold up the covers and put them away for each season. I'm um, also, oh, these are the fur. Guys, I might need a fur one, but I feel like my cats would just gross it up. I love that gray. I think that is so pretty for winter time. Um, these are the 20 by 20 pillows and I believe these are $14.99 to $19.99. So there's definitely a lot of options available for winter. Here's some more blankets. These are the less expensive blankets. I feel like they go from $3.99 to like $39.99 for all the different blankets that they offer. What I do like is Ikea tends to pick a couple color palettes and everything coordinates. So if you're looking to do something new at home, this is the place to go if you have one near you. Oh, that's a fur blanket. I just need that in my life, but it was $40. Um, so yeah, they have all different options available and we're going to turn around here and this one I love. It's like knitted or crocheted. I really enjoy that one. I'm trying to find the price tag and I think I'm going to find it. It's $19.99 if I remember. Oh, I remember. And then they also have it in a cream color. All right, here's, uh, these are sheep, faux sheepskin rugs. Um, they also are go from, I think, $9.99 to $24 or $29.99. Oh, these are fantastic to just lay out somewhere, especially if you're doing like a Nordic decor. Um, those are just some more all different sizes. And back there, they're a little larger and I think square. These baskets are great for holding blankets. Um, they are all wicker, even the black one. I was surprised at how lightweight it was. I love just sitting baskets around my house, storage. We're gonna come around here in a second. You can see my shadow. And all of those are storage baskets, which are pretty fantastic if you ask me. I feel like they have something for everybody. Um, up here, these are the ones that will fit in the calyx, those square buckets. Um, they have crates, they have baskets, they just have a really a wide variety of storage solutions just something fun to put on your bathroom those are stacking baskets i believe there's two or three in there uh square ones and then over here this is a collapsible square for the calyx and this one caught my eye so i beelined for it and i believe that's a picnic basket 34.99 these stars are fantastic and i'm deciding if i need to go back and get a couple for my mantle for christmas I was trying not to buy a bunch of stuff because really I have a bunch of stuff. But this is the area where you'll get picture frames, you can get prints. Um, the, it really is endless on the ways you can combine products. I'm going to show you here. These are like a shadow box and more of a standing frame, which I do enjoy for sure. And then down here we just have other sizes of frames. Uh, these are glass domes or cloches. I know Target is selling them in plastic, but if you want a more sturdy, oh, the hourglass. I was loving the hourglasses. I just think they're so pretty. Um, back to the glass, oh, greenery. <laughs> more glass domes at the bottom. I'll show you here in a second. And this is just tabletop decor. They have lots of different options. Those are different shapes and sizes, and they are all glass. Over here, we have some more hourglasses which I just love. I didn't buy one, but I like them. 
And then they have the stars also in white. And then just different, again, more tabletop decor that you can incorporate into your house. And all of the prices are pretty reasonable. You can go online and check out the pricing. Okay, we found Christmas. Fa -la, la These are the gnomes. I love them. They are so cute. Now, they're only going to have the two styles, red and green, and they're going to have them in multiple sizes. There's the girl, and then they have the boys, and I believe they go from like $7.99 to $19. That's just a, pa a palette of watercolors. Oh, the Santa. Heart-shaped, and his hands Velcro. He's so cute. I love that. I think, I feel like, well, I feel like the heart is very big. Uh, that's Christmas Jenga. And then these are the larger of the gnomes. More watercolors, good stocking stuffers. And some crayons. These are unfoldable or large stars, and they store folded up like this. And in a minute, I will show you how they hang. Just some decor they have out. But I believe that's plastic for an advent calendar. Paper, that's a paper lantern, and then these are plastic lanterns. There might be some metal involved, but the white is plastic. And then the larger of the lantern. These are the paper stars hung up, and what you can do is hang them plain, or you can get them with a light in the center. And they come in all different sizes. Um, those are string lights. They were a little expensive, but I'm sure they're decent quality on those. And this is the fabric line. These are table, or these are like dishcloths, tea towels. These are sponges, and they store flat, and I love them. I did end up picking up a pack. Because here you go, I'm grabbing one for me. I love them. They're great. And I believe you can put them in the washer. Those are hot pad holders in the, the design this year, which is going to be the red and white. Come down here, and there's a child size chef's hat, which I think is adorable. And then the child size apron. And I love that they put just as much quality in the kids' products. Um, these are just some gl green glass jars with lids. I think those will be fantastic on a coffee bar or to decorate. If you do like a red and green theme, I think those would be great. Uh, these are cookie cutters, just the smaller cookie cutters. And then this is the adult apron they put out this year for Christmas. Um, that theme, you're going to see that print is really throughout their Christmas decor. And that's only $6.99, and they're nice. I have one that I use in my craft room all the time. This is Melamine, and I believe this is part of their Christmas line, but I'm not 100% sure, to be honest with you. It feels like spring to me, but I liked it. It's pretty. These are just cloth napkins and table runners and trays. Now, that is definitely part of the Christmas line, and it's a table, full-size tablecloth. Very heavy-duty, nice, thick quality. It's not going to go anywhere. And then they have the red placemats and table runners. I think these are all placemats. And these jars, oh, these are fantastic. If you want to make some homemade vanilla, those are a good jar to do that in. And then the children's tray. All right, over here we have this three pack, and it comes with all three of those for $5.99, and they're half cup jars. So you get two red and one white, and they're $5.99. I love them. They are adorable, and now I'm putting it in my cart. Um, this is a heart-shaped napkin holder, and these are the table runners in the red. They have a nice texture to them, too, which I really enjoyed. That's for the napkins. And then these are champagne coolers, and then these dishes. Guys, I really contemplated getting some dishes, but I don't need dishes. They're so pretty, though. I love it. I believe that's a cardinal, if I had to guess. I'm not really a bird watcher. And these are serving bowls, and they're pretty decent size, and I love the different shapes that this stuff comes in. Just kind of admiring there. Now, these are pre-made gingerbread cookies, and you can decorate them. I don't know if the frosting was inside. I feel like it was, but I didn't really look that closely. Those are the gingerbread houses on this side. And those are tins of ginger cookies. 
And then these are tins of ginger crisps, and which are really good. They're thin. And then these cookies are cut out shapes, not houses, but gin those shapes. Then I'm pretty sure we can decorate these. I may go back and get some just to put in some cookie trays, but we'll see how that goes. My kids are mostly over that age. Uh, these are some Santa gummies, which I think are adorable. I should have got those for stockings. That's a wooden Christmas tree they haven't set up yet. And then more of the cookie trim tins. And this is their faux greenery. Look at those little tiny Christmas trees. They're $2 a piece. Same with the poinsettia. And then they have a variety of different size of pine or pine type trees. Um, they also have kissing balls, which are the round ones you can decorate. I was really contemplating those little trees, but I just need to take some inventory before I go out and buy stuff. Oh, but I am loving the little poinsettia. It feels very realistic to me, but they are 100% fake. This is a wall hanging, a wall shelf that stands up like a Christmas tree. You just hang it from the top and you get a bunch of shelves and some more vases and greenery. And these are little gnomes that are painted black. Why they are $6.99 is beyond me. Uh, crystal Christmas trees, which I think are pretty fantastic. I mean, I just think this is ridiculous. $7 for one. A basket, which I thought was nice. Buy a gnome at the Dollar Tree and spray paint it. Um, these are just plain white. They're just birds. $4.99 for that, another gnome, and then they have some bottle brush trees as well. So they are either wiped out of Christmas when I was here or not enough. That is potpourri. They haven't either maybe gotten it out. Those are the ornaments they're coming out with this year, and these wooden ornaments I wanted, but they didn't have them in stock. These I'm going to show you are, those are brass snowflakes, super pretty. And then this package here, that's the wooden stars. There's the um, kissing balls. And then these are like books. You open them up and they're paper ornaments, but they look like book pages. I just didn't see the wood shapes. So I'm hoping I'll go back in a couple weeks and they'll have them. Um, this is the reason, one of the reasons I went was for a pillow cover with the gnomes on it, but I didn't see it. But they did have the trees and then they had the deer. And these are 20 by 20. And then this, oh, these pillows here, I'm loving this one. I think I need that for winter time for my bed, but we'll see. I didn't get it. But I like it. It's very fluffy. And that's some more faux fur. And they just have a variety of faux fur colors. And then this is the gift wrap section. So those are a pack of 50 gift tags. They come in two different uh, patterns, one with the animals and the woodland creatures and one more plain. And then the washi, this is a three-pack with the red and the craft paper color. And then this one, I was trying to see if I could get a good view, but it's Christmas trees with Santa, and I think it's a fox. Super cute. And then these, I did a terrible job videoing, are gift boxes in the tree shape. And they're red on the inside, and I really liked those, but I don't really have a need for that right now. Um, but I did apparently have a need for that. This is the candles they have for the holiday. So tapered candles and red and white and then some holders. Um, this vase I thought was adorable and I love the bubble texture. That whole, Those are your tea light holders, I believe. Just line those up on your table. And then some more vases. And then this red and green are, tea, are um, taper candle holders. So you put your taper candles, although the red one, I'm sure you could do both. And those are the tea lights. And then the houses, these are all metal. Uh, so you have a lantern, and that's metal, it's very large. And then these little houses, it says you can put a candle in there, but I'm not sure. And then down here we have the white and the red lantern. The white is something they carry year-round. The red, I think they bought out for Christmas this year. And I love the little lanterns. I think they're really pretty. And then just some more lanterns, some more houses. So typically they'll put them on display. And then this red candle pack. Hi guys, I hope you enjoyed that little tour through Ikea. It was a pretty quick tour because there was surprisingly a lot of people
hovering about. I'm like, honey, you can keep going. You don't have to watch me. That's okay. I thought I would show you what I bought. Um, I got a cutting board. Um, this was $7.99. I mean, the prices are so reasonable. And I believe this is... I can't remember what it said the wood was. But it's a cutting board, but I'm gonna use it for a charcuterie board for Thanksgiving and Christmas. I need some tea. Okay, then I know I showed you these. These are um, wash dishcloths. They're just thin and when you wet them, they absorb and then they dry firm again. Sweden, Swedish dish cloths, I believe, but I like them because they had the Christmas tree on them. I did get two of these, different sizes. I love their zip bags. They are reusable because they are pretty sturdy. This one is 2.5 liter and 1.2 liter. Uh, you get 25 of each, and this one is 2.5 liter, and you get 25 of each so with the holidays coming I need I figured I needed some for cookies and stuff I did grab two white pillowcases for my Christmas bed and I'm pretty sure I have two black somewhere as well and then the duvet pillowcases but they're a great deal this was like $6.99 for two for my charcuterie board I did grab two of these little bowls I love them it's in green mostly for like olives and dip and stuff I figured I could use a couple of these and then a couple clear those were $1.49 and then also for my charcuterie board I grabbed these little tiny jars with the seal on them you get two with the red I think that's their version of a poinsettia and one white again for my charcuterie board because I can put my jam and stuff in here and shut it put it in the fridge and then when I want it out to display just pull it out of the fridge and I love this size especially for a single person I you get they're four ounces so each of them would hold a half a cup of some kind of a dip or whatever olives homemade jelly tapenade anything artichoke hearts things like that that maybe we won't eat all of and I can just slap the lid back on and put it in the fridge and it'll stay fresh so I grab that um, I did get some washi because I've been going through my Christmas washi and I thought that was fun. Oh, sorry. And you get three rolls and a fair amount on each roll. Part of the thing is these, the, most of this stuff's not in English, so I have no idea. And then the reason that I came ooh, was, um, I love these pillow covers so I don't buy fresh pillows all the time I have four pillow forms actually I have more than that but I have four on my couch and then I just buy the covers and I only have to store the cover I went in for the gnomes but they didn't have them so I found the reindeer for my bed I want to do my bedroom in gnomes but if I can't find the gnome pillow cover at least I have this for my Christmas bed I do my bedroom for the holidays and by that I mean I have a festive duvet cover for my bed I put a garland on my headboard and I will decorate the top of my dresser so I don't go overboard but I definitely bring some Christmas cheer upstairs and I love having my lighted garland on my headboard and I have it set on a timer so I go to sleep and then it stays on for like an hour after I fall asleep and it's so fun all right that's everything that I picked up. I hope you enjoyed this first look at the Ikea Christmas stuff. I don't really know what else they're going to be getting in, but I hope those gnome pillows. So I'm going to have to keep my eye on the website. All right, guys, I hope you have a good one and I'll talk to you later. Bye.